The Clearing Season 1, Episode 6, Thoughts. This episode is called The Pied Piper. So, spoilers for these first six episodes and another episode that I absolutely loved. Now, let's see. So, it does... Yeah, we're, there's still not a set, you know, maybe there will be another season, maybe not. If not, then there's only two episodes left. So, but, but I think that is enough to wrap everything up. Yeah, so they're able to arrest Matreya by, you know, asking that she sign for a package. And I like, you know, we hear her priorities upon being arrested. You know, she says, get me a change of clothes, my makeup, and my lawyer in that order. And Anton is really cruel, telling Freya, you know, I feel sorry for Billy for having you as a mother. And this is especially awful if it really is true that he is the father of Tyler. You know, it, it would be completely unacceptable even without. But if he is a father himself and he knows what it's like to be afraid that you, you know, hurt your own child, just, yeah. But, you know, that's the, the, yeah, they, they are, they have learnt cruelty because of the abuse of the cult. And, you know, the, yeah, but I believe it's Matreya claims to, to Freya, we're not, you know, we're no longer taking kids. We have squatters, you know, and I, I appreciate, like, that does sound very unlikely. Why would a squatter choose the, the, you know, to climb down there and, and stay? Why wouldn't they just stay in the room that has the, the, um, the, the door and the, the ladder down there, you know? And when Matreya slaps Anton, he looks like a child again. They, I, they do a really great job on that, uh, you know. It's yeah, it's it's like he's just a, a you know a, a scared child again who's upset that his his mother is disappointed, kind of thing, you know. And yeah, Joe gives Henrik a ride, you know, after he's been in prison for 22 years and tries to get some information and you know based on the end of this episode yeah he he is you know part of it again so or still I suppose I should say he's just been waiting and they've been waiting until he got out but he claims you know yeah he he doesn't tell Joe anything and I really appreciate M Matreya's reaction, you know, she says, they said I was a flight risk, can you believe it? Like, even, I mean, this isn't, this isn't the, the furthest along in the timeline we've seen, but, like, she's, she seems legitimately completely incapable of or unwilling to reflect at all, because, like, of course she's a flight risk. She fled already once. You know, they had to get Interpol involved to even get her back for a trial. Of course they consider her a flight risk. But she thinks that it's the most absurd thing. You know, she it really is. Like, the, the cult live in their own world. And, yeah, she's she's scared of the the other inmates, which is... You know, that, that is something you hear from a lot of people who didn't think they would end up in jail. And, yeah, Dr. Bryce is forced to resign because of the, the yeah, his connection to, and, you know, he threatens Colin that they're going to reveal the tapes, the, the clearing tapes, 
And I gotta say, the next part confused me a little. He goes in, Colin goes into the, the you know, and, and it's, you know, Colin reiterates, you know, he saw the way that the children had been abused. He is not going to, to protect them from the law anymore. But, but yeah, then he goes into the, the, um, I'm not good at, I, I'm guessing the chief or something, the, the, he's of a higher rank, you know, and says, and he, he confesses that he's gay, and the chief is like, okay, sure, you know, that's fine, I guess, was that illegal back then, maybe? Or at least, I mean, certainly there are places where it's still frowned upon. I, I don't know enough about, because this is still, this is set in, like, Australia or, um, I forget if it, yeah, right now I don't remember if it's Australia or if it's the, the, uh, Australia or New Zealand. I felt like I heard New Zealand. Anyway, the, the, yeah, I'm not, I don't know enough about their laws to, you know, I mean, surely that wasn't all that there would be on the clearing tapes, is it? Presumably he could get in trouble just for being a member of the cult and not disclosing that. You know, I don't know if membership of the cult would necessarily be illegal, but certainly there would be you know, he, he would have to disclose that and recuse himself. A anyway. Now, the... That brings us to the... Um, right, right, yeah. Uh, Freya gets into the, the hospital room where Carrie Anderson is still recovering. And I like that just briefly, you know, she sees Sarah there. You know, we still don't know. I really hope this season doesn't end on a cliffhanger. I mean, that's more of a Netflix thing, thing than a Disney Plus thing. So far, Disney Plus has been pretty good about... I, I haven't watched every single Disney Plus show, but like MCU and, and such, they tend to finish off the story by the end of the... The first season, but anyway, yeah, the the at, at least so much that you don't that they don't need a, a second season. But anyway, yeah, we still don't know what happened with with Sarah and Carrie. You know, it's it. I appreciate because like if it turns out that there's no, you know, that she never was kidnapped by the cult. You know, maybe she's just. I mean, if they're if she's recovering. It's possible they gave her something to to sleep on, some kind of drug that may have her like imagining things or something, you know, s dreaming very very vivid dreams or something, you know. But she says, "I am, I am in the light," which does definitely does sound like something she might have heard a cult member say. And, you know, Freya actually does get arrested, and it is like, yeah, you know, and, and she tells the, the cop, oh, you know, I just know about the case because I saw it on the news. Half, you know, what was the, half the country saw the, followed the case on the news. They didn't break into the, you know, the hospital, which is also just like, you know, we we get where she's coming from. We understand that she thinks she's helping stop the cult, stop stop, you know, kidnapping and child abuse. But you you cannot do that. that's completely unacceptable. And she, you know, it's one of those things where she, the reason she broke into the hospital is because she knows if she asked, they would have said no. You know, no, you ex cult member cannot, in fact talk to someone that you think may have been kidnapped. The, the police think that the police are not sure she's been kidnapped and, you know, the, the you know, she's not, like, working for the cops. She's not a reporter or anything. There's no way that she's just going to get, yeah. 
and you know Colin allows the you know gets her set free and she calls Joe and let's see yeah and Henrik is attacked you know, yeah, Henrik is harassed and then attacks a guy over the music, which to him is this just amazing thing, you know. I also appreciate, like, even even racists in, in like, Australia, New Zealand, you know, Great Britain in general, they're also, you know, like Americans, they don't know, like... I'm not going to repeat the, the word because it's a slur, but he uses a word that starts with D and ends in O and it's four letters long. You know, that's not that's not even remotely what Henrik, you know, but he's like, oh, it's a foreigner. I don't know. It's probably that, right? Let's see. And uh, yeah, it's, it's later that he, you know, when, when Freya shows up, he says, I'm glad, you know, good riddance, him and his music and 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 I do want to make it clear I don't think that the the show or episode is racist for having the word it's just you know it's characterization the, the you know and that is also something you know some people like if they get out of jail and they don't have a lot of options they might end up a place that has you know really really hateful awful people like that I mean it's music calm down you know, even, even if he's being loud with it, at, you know, talk to him like an adult. Let's see. Yeah, and we... Let's see. Yeah, Wayne is not allowed to pick up Billy, you know, and the... the just... Yeah. Um, you know, Freya specifically did not want... Wayne to, you know, and now she got herself arrested. May I have a word? You just had five. We're not made of words. And, yeah, you know, Freya shows up and, and picks up Billy and, you know, she she's, she's sad that Max isn't you know, talking to her, which, you know, of course, the audience knows that's because of Anton. And we briefly see the lead-up to the trial, and Anton is trying to stop Freya from testifying. And, yeah, Anton drives Maxine to meet Ada, and the, the, uh, what's it called? Yeah, and, and, you know, it's, it's yeah, he, he says, this is a way to piss off your dad, and he's got beer. Yeah, a lot of teenagers are going to go for that. And, yeah, Ada tries to appeal to her, and she claims, you know, she, she, she knows that Maxine doesn't have a great relationship with her mother, and so she, she appeals to that. You know, she says, I was fortunate enough that my mother and I had a very close relationship, which we know is just a complete and utter lie. You know, that nothing could be further from the truth, basically. But, you know, rewriting the past to make it uncomplicated you know, that makes it easier to manipulate people. You know, ba like, basically, Ada is saying, if you become part of this group of the clearing, or the, the kindred, you know, you're going to have close relationships to, to people. And if you have, you know, yeah, you're going to be part of a group that is made up of close-knit relationships, you know. And that's, you know, it's, it's a common predatory tactic to prey on people who feel a strong need for, for something, you know, and yeah, it is very, very, you know, it can hurt a lot to, to not have a good relationship with your parents. And 
yeah, Bilbo finds a flute and starts playing, and, you know, it's one of those things, some of the time, Freya is just paranoid, but this is appears to be a time where she's absolutely right. And, yeah, you know, Joe doesn't find anyone and offers to stay and, you know, points out they can change the locks and... You know, and, and that is the thing, like, if you know what you're doing with, like, you know, lock picking and that kind of thing, you can make it seem like you don't, you know, you can, you can hide that you broke in. You know, you can, you can pick the lock, you know, he could go in, put the, put the flute on, you know, and then leave and and lock the door behind him and it would seem as though nothing has yeah and yeah we see when Ada goes free and yeah we get the line she can't hurt us you know which is I, I appreciate that exact wording it's not you're safe here, or she can't get to us here, but she can't hurt us. Which, you know, we've seen a lot of scenes that are set after that scene. Clearly, she still can. And Tamsin is not part of celebrating the, the freedom. So, yeah, there is some chance that she's... Yeah. Is... Could she be acting on her own? Maybe. Anyway. And I appreciate the, the use of the word grooming when when Freya confronts Anton. You know, it's a, it's a very charged... It, it always has been a fairly charged word, but right now it is extremely charged. You know, and I... I don't know exactly when they filmed this, but I would be very surprised if they filmed it before the that word became so charged and yeah Anton introduces Tyler and Freya to each other and then Tyler gets the flute and Anton points out you know Henrik has been released mom has been talking to him and, you know, we see that he appears to have been the one who carved the flute. And certainly that goes with, like, I, I forget if we've seen... Yeah, yeah, he's like handyman kind of thing, you know. So, so yeah, 100% you could believe that, that he was the one who... Yeah, and Freya sees that the kindred remain active, which just, yeah, incredibly chilling to to think but yeah um really looking forward to seeing how this is resolved i i'm still like i feel like there's just enough i guess i guess at this point it probably there there's probably at least some present day cult activity but it does not seem like the um yeah anyway um right i i made a reference to to netflix just to clear up it's not that i have netflix i just watched this video actually i think i'll i'll link it in the description box it's it's really really good um I f what was it called again i'll have it momentarily because it's like, was it yesterday or something? Um, Netflix versus the world, reacting to your streaming hot takes was the, the video. I'll, I'll put that in the, in the description box. But that was where I, I heard that, you know, Netflix does a lot of these shows where a season will end in a cliffhanger and then it will get cancelled. So, anyway, um... Yes, I will probably do a Scream Queens episode one of the next couple of days, and I am planning to cover a movie Saturday, so hope to catch you then. Bye.